Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today we're going to be filming um, basically a face of first impressions. There are a few products that I received from Octoly. They were sent to me and I'm here to review them. So I figured I'd do a full face of first impressions and just tell you what I think about it and then obviously follow up with a review or whatever. Maybe it'll be a favorite, who knows. So yeah. So I just washed my face so I'm gonna go in with the Clarins Hydra Essential by Serum Intensive Moisture Quenching by Phase Serum. So yeah, basically this, what this is supposed to do is that it's supposed to make your dry skin very um, moisturized and it's an intensive moisturizer. So yeah, I'm excited to try this out. My um, my skin has been really bad this winter, so it's been really dry, so I've basically been trying to find products that are gonna make my skin look better. You only have to use one pump of this, basically, so I'm just gonna pump that, and it's kind of like a gel. It already, so I'm just gonna rub this in between. And the good thing about this is that it's not oily. And it doesn't have an oily consistency at all. And it doesn't feel like you're even moisturizing your face. Like I feel like, I don't know, it's like a serum. It's super lightweight, but it's like, it's there. My face, my face feels so good. The first time I used this, I did um, the Clay Tox Detox Mask, the videos on my Instagram, and I used this after I used the mask, and I actually really liked it. It was really good on my skin, and I liked how it felt. So, this is a good for me so far. I do like that so far. So the next three products that I'm going to talk about, we're all going to use together. Um, they're all three. They're all new products. I received the Hulip. Hulip? You know what I'm saying though. Hulip Booster Radiance. Um, this is a reparative oil. And I'm actually super excited because you can use this with foundations, um, moisturizers. Um, you can use it alone. There's a lot of things that this is very versatile and I like this. So maybe this will make my foundations glowy, hopefully. So I'm gonna try this with another new product that I was sent. It's by Eden Minerals. And this is the North Skin Pure Mineral Illuminating Foundation. And this is in the color 203. And I'm really excited. The packaging is pretty cute. And I did swatch this. And this is my color. So... I'm pretty excited about that. Let's see? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I know. I'm pale. Stop. Put these two together. And also, there's another thing that I'm going to add in this because it is kind of like one of those extra things that you can add. So this is a booster from Clarins. It's a booster detox. It detoxifies and revives radiance of a dull complexion. It plumps the skin. So this is meant for like congested skin and if it's for, it says it's meant for partying, overindulging, like eating junk food or eating sweets or anything, salty foods, anything like that, that'll make your face break out. Smoking environments and extreme pollution. Um, so basically this is just something a little extra that will help your skin. So these two can both be used with foundations, moisturizers, um, after face masks, alone, anything like that. These are very versatile products and this is the reason why I wanted them so badly. I'm going to take the foundation and I'm going to pump this onto my beauty blender. We'll do like three, four. And then I'm, it says one to two drops for the Hulip. We're gonna put two. Booster Detox, and then it says use three to five. I'll use three. I'm gonna use the minimum because I don't know how this is gonna end up. You get the point. That was so hard to do. Guess what, Evilly? 
distributes. This is like a really good scent. Like, I don't know, but I do like the combination of these scents. The foundation has no scent to it, so it should be the oil. Yeah, it's the oil. It smells kind of like minty or eucalypty. I don't know how I feel about this. So I'm gonna set this with my Airspun Loose Powder. So I'm gonna go in with the MAC Prep and Prime 24 Hour Extend Eye Base. I'm gonna take my Anastasia Beverly Hills Modern Renaissance Palette and I'm gonna take Burnt Orange and Raw Sienna. And I'm gonna put this in my crease using my E35 Blending Brush from Sigma. Next I'm gonna take this BH Cosmetics 103 Shader Brush Juan Fresco. And I'm gonna pat this all over the lid. And then after that, I'm gonna go in with the color Antique Bronze. And I'm gonna put this on the outer corners. I'm gonna go into my Tardiest Pro palette and I'm gonna be taking the shade Whimsy and I'm gonna go in with the Sigma E25 blending brush and I'm gonna go in the crease and kind of go over and join these two colors right here. And then after that, I'm gonna go in with the Tardiest Clay Paint Liner and I'm gonna go in with a liner brush, any angled liner brush. After that, I'm gonna go back into that shade Punk and I'm gonna smoke out that liner. I'm gonna go in with Cypress Umber and I'm just gonna go on the outer right here. Right, so next we're gonna go in with the Kat Von Z Locket Concealer. This is in the shade L3 Warm. And we're gonna clean up underneath. I'm gonna take my Tardius Pro Glow palette and I'm gonna go in with the powder sculpt shade right here. And I'm gonna go in with a F10 powder blush brush. So after that, um, we're gonna go and start the bottom lash line with the shade Burnt Orange and Regular. Swipe this on the lower lash line. Then I'm gonna go in with this antique bronze color. And then after that, I'm going to take that cypress umber shade up here and I'm gonna put that on the outer third so next is highlighter and I'm going to be taking my E40 blending brush from Sigma this is my favorite to highlight with and I'm gonna take stunner and strobe and I usually mix these two together and we're gonna highlight Yes, mm. yes, sugar. 
I'm also gonna take that highlight and I'm gonna put it under, I'm gonna pop that under my brow bone. After that, I'm gonna take a pencil brush and I'm gonna go in with that black shade we used to smudge out the liner. All right, so I picked up um, Mellow Wine by Wet n Wild. And I'm gonna go in with this Duo Fiber Powder Brush, the F15. And I'm just gonna take a little. So I'm gonna go in with the Love Spell Cosmetics Velvet Matte Liquid Lipstick in the shade Aurora. Okay guys, so this is the finished look. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this. Final thoughts, um, the foundation, um, so far I don't like, I don't like how it wears and I don't like how it looks on my skin. It's not enough coverage as much as I want and it's really drying on my skin, um, and yeah. Um, I'm gonna try it again without all the oils and everything, maybe it's just the oils or how it's performing or whatever. You never know, so yeah. Um, the Booster Detox, I will probably use again by itself just to see how it works or with a moisturizer. And then the Booster Radiance Oil, I did like how these smelled. They did have a good fragrance. The Hulip one especially does have a good fragrance. So I'm excited to keep using this and see how my skin looks. So that's it, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. Um, I will be posting my uh, my giveaway up on my Instagram. I'll link all my social media up here. Um, other than that, I hope you guys enjoyed it, and thanks for watching.